right, so right now we're at Victory Heights Bible Camp. Uh, this is a camp facility that's on top of a mountain here in Trend City. And it's just up the road, maybe a half mile walk from Aruka Baptist Church where the Westbrooks have their church where we'll be ministering all week. And this is a beautiful place up here. It's a fully gated camp with security. And there's a number of places for, there's actually a pool, which is pretty cool. Um, there's also a number of dormitories that we'll have access to. Of course, there's basketball courts and just a great place for us to hang out when we're not ministering at the church or in the city. So this will be the spot where we'll be at. We'll be staying uh, all during our time here with our teams and just wanted you all to, to get a look at it. Hi, my name is Jimmy Westbrook, and me and my family, we are missionaries here on the island of Trinidad. And uh, today we've got a group of young people up here at Lavigi Perriman Lookout, and you can see the view is spectacular. But uh, we just want to say thank you to you for your interest in Trinidad. We're excited that Trinity is interested in partnering with us and uh, sending a team down. And uh, so we are excited that you are, are interested in Trinidad and we want to welcome you to come and serve the Lord here. There's lots of ministry opportunity here in Trinidad. And one of the great things about Trinidad is that they speak English here in Trinidad. And so you don't have to have a translator, don't have to have you know, any type of foreign language skills. And uh, so uh, this is a great place to minister, lots of opportunities in the community, lots of opportunities in our church. And so we welcome you to come and minister with us. We wanna say thank you to Trinity Baptist Church for your faithful support. And we wanna say thank you to you for your interest in Trinidad. We hope to see you here soon. So you may be asking why. Why is it important for me to send my child on a mission trip? Or why is it important for me to attend a mission trip? Well, we read a lot in the Bible about how the eye affects the heart and the things that you see really impact who you are. So it's all about changing our view of what God can do in and through us. And when you're on a foreign mission field, you get to spend time with our mission partners and you see their heart for the people and you get to connect with people that are not from America they may speak a different language, but they love Jesus just as passionately as you would, and they have a heart for their people. It really changes you. It changes you on the inside. And as you learn about how God can change you on the inside, we encourage you to take it back home with you and to tell our students and our teams to take this and put it into work in your schools, in your communities, in your neighborhoods. But then not only that, it's neat to see how God can use you and work through you just in a week long mission trip. And you can impact people there for eternity with the gospel. And as you continue to come back to the same place, it's neat to see how they're growing, how they're making a difference for Jesus. So it's all about changing your view of what God can do in and through you. And that's what it's about to help everyday people discover an extraordinary life with God. And really to talk more specifically about life change and, and really what happens when you go on mission together. Here's a more personal story. I remember one of the first mission trips that I was able uh, to take here at Trinity with the team. We went to Haiti and obviously it was a culture shock. It was an incredible experience with a group of teenagers. But there's one teenager I remember taking first mission trip, I believe it was his first flight ever. And going on this trip, he um, saw how God is at work in Haiti. Also, we saw a lot of poverty and a lot of people that are having a really difficult time of life and people that need uh, a redeemer. And not only that, I think it really changed his heart for how he could use his skill set and what God could do in his life through the gifts and abilities that he had. In fact, he's holding the camera right now. Uh, his name's Trent Warren. And he could probably give you a little bit better idea than I could, but I think he's been in most every continent now filming and doing photography and helping out mission partners and it's so cool to look back and see how that all started with uh, Trent committing to go on a Haiti missions trip for one week and the change that, that brought in his life and how he is now using his gifts and abilities to impact thousands of people uh, through missionary work and through our church so you never know what God's going to do when you surrender and you go on mission together.